We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Miami Marlins. Who's going to win the battle between these two? We'll see next. At the plate, Skeeter Diddy. He'll swing it from the left side right here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. See it up there. Here's the pitch. These Phillies, as they enter play here tonight, fellas, they're on a great run of late as they come in winners of seven of their last nine games. Yeah, Matty, I think if you would have asked the manager of this team, first five games. Here's a fly here. ball, well here. hit. Going back is the right fielder. Gone! A solo shot here to straightaway right field. Number 26 for him on the season. And the Marlins have taken a 2 to nothing lead. Striding in, Skeeter Diddy. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. Now a throw over and the runner back safely. And another throw over and a dive, but he's back in there. Wait for a good one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And a pitch out. Nothing doing, though, and that's ball one. So let's take a peek at our umpiring crew in this one. Working the plate is Larry Bullard. Hey, behind the dish, d row Larry Bullard. Pretty standard guy. Works it. The only problem, I think, at times, hitters have a little bit difficult time. He'll give a little bit on an inside corner and outside it's corner. Not very it's consistent. Cut. Yeah, but Larry's approachable. That's the one thing. If you turn around and say, is that as far as you're going on the outer half, he's usually going to tell you. Now a move over to first, and he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. Drive that pitch now, eh? Hit out towards second. That gets through, and he'll reach base again on his second base hit of the game. Stepping up now, Skeeter Diddy. He singled his last time up. Skeeter. First pitch on its way. And he pops up the bun attempt. Franco is there and he has it for the... Up next from Miami, Skeeter Diddy as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Really doesn't matter what side the play that this guy bats from. He hits very well. He hits right-handed pitching very well. Swinging left-handed and swinging from the right side against lefties. The numbers are quite the same. This guy flat out can hit from either side. Well, that's just a great job of battling on the road. They fought all the way to the end, took the lead in the top of the ninth, and secured the W in the bottom half. That's a great team win. And it's a 4-3 finish in this evening's ball game. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Miami Marlins and the Pittsburgh Pirates. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Digging in, Skeeter Diddy, first shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. This guy's had a super season so far, and we're well into the baseball season, so this isn't a fluke. He's been swinging the bat great all year. Hard hit ball to second, and that finds its way through for a base hit. Coming to the plate now, Skeeter Diddy, and he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Hey, your pitch right here. Let's go. Oh, big dog, right time. Oh, let it fly. He's ready. Here's the first offering. There's a fastball right down Broadway taken hey, for a strike. Dero, Dan, we look at this Pirates ball club as they enter play here tonight. They've had it going the last 10 games. They're 7 and 3 of them. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. 
at the plate. Skeeter Diddy will swing it from the left side right here. Really doesn't matter what side of the plate of this guy bats from. He hits very well. He hits right-handed pitching very well. Swinging left-handed and swinging from the right side against lefties. The numbers are quite the same. This guy flat out can hit. Coming to the plate now. Skeeter Diddy. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. Looking to keep this a one-run game. The pitch fouled off. Two runs, eight hits, and no errors in the game for the Marlins. Again, another foul ball. You see it ripping up there. Rounded softly down the line toward first. Oh. But a foul ball, and the count holds it 0 2. Hey, one time, right now. 0 2. Here it is. Slow grounder to first. Bell picks it up, and he'll step yeah. on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Leading off the inning, Skeeter Diddy as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Hit softly on the ground to first. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down. So a big spot here in stepping in. Skeeter Diddy, and he could very well get the intentional pass here as that would set up a potential double play ball that might keep the game tied. Now a spin and a throw back to second. And late reactions, and they got him. Here comes the first pitch. Hey, see it. Drive it like you can. Let's go. Down the third baseline. But this will get foul for strike two. Here's the 0-2. And he strikes him out on a good pitch. So one run can win it as we head to the bottom of the inning. Now in the box, Skeeter Diddy. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. Here we go. It needs it right here. Oh, uh, working ahead. Here's the first pitch. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Dickerson's after it. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Man, that was definitely a hard-earned victory, but that's what's going to make it even more satisfying. They take it in 12 innings on the road, and it's all smiles now. This one comes to a close with a 9-5 final. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Ought to be a good one here between the Miami Marlins and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Major League Baseball on the Show is next. Stepping in, Skeeter Diddy he comes in today leading the National League in hitting this year. One of the best hitters in baseball, and he does it with some damage, too. Lots of extra base hits. He's in the top five in the league in slugging percentage as well. Newman is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Digging in to try it again. Skeeter Diddy, he flew out in his last at bat. Diddy. First delivery to him on the way. Now he turns on a fastball and sends it deep down the right field line. And that is off the wall. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. So he's quickly into scoring position. Late Skeeter Diddy. And Dan, I'm sure the starter on the mound would like to hit the rewind button on that last inning. Oh, no doubt about that, Mac. That was a really rocky frame. But clearly not enough to chase him from this game. We'll see if he's still shaking a bit or if he's able to put this behind him. I think for every player, for every former player, that swing right there is the reason we need to extend the netting without question. Want the fans to be safe. 
from the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Hit out towards second, scooped up. And the off balance out. throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. Digging in now, Skeeter now Diddy, back. as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Let's go, kid. All right, let's sit on something you like right here. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Swing and a hard hit ball down the line in right. And this is going to get down for extra bases as that'll get one, if not both of them, home. And that's going to plate the tying run from second, and we are all even at five aside. Ready for another shot now. Skeeter, Diddy, two doubles for him to this point in the game. All right, you got this. Let's go, let's go. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Turned on, but it's wide of first and foul. Here's the 0-1. And it's fouled away. Right guy, right spot. Come on now, kid. Oh, and 2 here it comes. A long inning as they've hung a nine spot on him to this point. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Bell is there to make the catch and mercifully the side is finally retired. Standing in, now Skeeter Diddy. Come on, Diddy. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Swing, high drive, left field and deep. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Well, the discussion around this game is real easy. It goes back to that big sixth inning when they put everything together. They really broke out there and just brought it home after that. 13-7 is how this one ends. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the Chicago Cubs and the Miami Marlins. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. He's going to look to turn things around in this one here today. The left fielder, Peter Giddy. Come on, kid. Get on for us. Here we go. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Ball, Skeeter Diddy is in with two away as he takes a ball 1-0. Oh. Well, guys, as we look at the Cubs coming into play here tonight, they come in in a bit of a rough patch. They've dropped four in a row. Yeah, Maddie, this is the perfect guy to have on the mound. A veteran, not going to let the moment get too big for him. Nobody Completely understands what's being right asked there. of him. They've been losing lately. That can't be denied. But this is the perfect guy. Right guy, right spot. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball. But the pitcher went to breaking ball. And the hitter just fouls that one off. Still a ball and two strikes. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. Bases are empty here with two men out. Hey, stay hot, huh? Line to the right side, fall in, fall in, but a foul ball. The one two. Fouled away. Are you serious right here? This is becoming a joke. Eight foul balls in a row. This guy is in auto swing mode. This pitcher could throw this. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Now batting, Skeeter now batting. Diddy. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Diddy. First pitch on its way. And this pitch just about saws him off as he can't get extended at all. It's strike one. 
These are the moments in the game that can sway it one way or another while you get a W or a loss right here. Leadoff man on, heart of the order coming up. Guy out on the mound, this guy's work cut out for him. Come on, baby. See it, drive it. Let's go. Oh, and two count. Here's the pitch. Pulled toward right center field. Waiting on it is Almora. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. So stepping in, Skeeter Diddy. He flew out in his last at bat. Here comes the first pitch. And now the runner's trying for third. In the dirt. Oh, and the pitch is low, and it won't be dug out, so he's going to take third on the stolen base. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. One one. One and one. The Shields hey, takes his lead at third hey, with it. one away. Wait for your pitch up there. Johnny hammers it to get deep rings, right Bob. field. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. They'll cash in here as the run is in to score from third. It's five to two. And he is in at third base. Into the box. Skeeter Diddy as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Really doesn't matter what side the plate of this guy bats from. He hits very well. He hits right-handed pitching very well. Swinging left-handed and swinging from the right side against lefties. The numbers are quite the same. This guy flat out can hit from either side. Hey, it's hey, nearly impossible to turn two with a guy that could run like this. It's even harder when he comes out of the box hitting from the left side. You really need something tailor-made to even have a chance to get him at first. He pulls this one into right. Hayward is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. And that save number 33 on the season for him, matching my career best for a season. The difference is he still has a chance to notch number 34. Another nice outing from him. And tonight's comes to an end, 6-3 to three the final. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Today we've got a good matchup ahead between the Chicago Cubs and the Miami Marlins. Chicago attempt to end a six-game losing streak. Next. Stepping into the box, Skeeter Diddy. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. Pitch on the way. Hit in the air out to straightaway left. Half is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Skeeter Diddy, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Grounder down the line at third. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Digging in, Skeeter did he? He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. No balls in one strike. Oh, baby. Get your pitch up there. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. That's the ball. No ball, runs, three play. hits, and no errors in the game for the Marlins. Uh, tough to get fooled any one worse than that. Down. He's in a hole now, one and two. You see that swing right there? You know what that tells me, boys? Go, that this pitcher is doing his job right here. But also, the offense is obviously not picking anything up today. And he fouls this one off. And a half-hearted swing there as they tie him up inside for the third strike. And the inning is... Now at the plate, up Skeeter Diddy. No hits in three oh, tries so far. He's struck Skeeter. out once. Diddy. Hey, make it yours. <laughs> oh. 
first pitch of the at bat. A swing and a ground ball to third. And oh, the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag, and he'll reach it first. Have to be made knowing who you've got at the plate. This guy can put one over the fence, no problem. So that wasn't very smart baseball. A single run good enough to do it today. One nothing, the final score. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the Miami Marlins. It's Baseball on the Show, and it's coming up next. Stepping into the box, Skeeter Diddy. First shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. This guy can do just about everything when he's in the lineup. In the top five in the league in runs scored, and he's a big part of this offense. So there's oh, more to this guy high. than just swinging a bat. He can get on base, too. Well, guys, you take a look at this Diamondback squad as they begin play here tonight. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Yeah, Maddie, this road trip's been a little bit of a struggle for this team. First four games, they find themselves one and three. Haven't played particularly well. They'll find a way to regroup. They have to find a way to play a little bit more fundamentally sound. Start there first. The one-two. Right side. He'll get to this one deep in the hole. Throw to first in plenty of time. Stepping in and ready for another now shot. Right. Skeeter Diddy. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Hey, yeah, Matty, expect back. this Let's pitcher go. to try and get the same result. That's his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll two. Hey, this is a left-handed hitter that can fly down the line. If they want to Let turn two, right they're going to have to be almost perfect. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Popped him up. Echeverria. Is calling for it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Digging in once now again. Back. Skeeter Diddy. He flew out Skeeter. in his last at bat. First delivery to him on the way. Now he spins on one here and drives it to deep right field. And it's gone! A solo shot here to straightaway right field. Number 28 on the season as the Marlins have rallied back to tie it at two apiece. Stepping in, Skeeter Diddy. Only four outs remaining for them to try and rally back in this one. Yeah, Matt, that last one wasn't exactly a tape measure shot. But listen, a home run is a home run. I know a lot of pitchers, they call that a wall scraper in his last A-B. But listen, it counts as a home run nonetheless. And they are not going to get him at first. He's aboard easily. More and more common in baseball now these days to use a ton of pitchers to get through a game. And it took six here to get the job done. But, hey, they'll do whatever they can to get a W. And tonight's comes to an end. Six to three, the final. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the Miami Marlins. Major League Baseball on the show starts now. Now with the plate, Skeeter Diddy he comes in today, That's leading the National League in hitting this year. There's no way Skeeter. you could have forecasted Diddy. this kind of season from this guy. Not to take anything away from him, but I don't think many people in baseball considered him to be one of the league's best hitters for average coming into this year. Ready for another chance? Oh, Skeeter Diddy will no swing it from the left side right Skeeter. here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. Hit hard to the right. Foul. Popped up. Lamb is under it. He's got it, and there are two down now. Hey, let her rip one time. 
Greinke comes set. Here comes the first pitch. Swing and a line drive. But just fouls as he just misses extra bases. He was hey, absolutely no all there. over go. that fastball. Have to find a way to keep that fair. Behind 0-2 now. In a big spot like this, you have to be looking for something you can handle. That pitch bunched him up completely. So I think he's trying to do a little bit too much right now. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Souza is there and he makes the catch for the out. So a pivotal now moment back. here in Let's digging in now. Skeeter, Skeeter. Diddy, and Skeeter. he does so representing the possible go-ahead run. First offering on its way. Tries to get the bunt down here, but this is foul, and we'll see if he tries it again. Here comes the 0-1. Bunt attempt is popped into foul ground. This one, everything we could have hoped for. 3-2 to two in inning number 8. Not in front of that one, but he stays alive, and will do it again on 0-2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Ball. One ball, two strike. Hey, have a rip. Like the chance. Weak grounder back to the mound. To second for one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two and it gets him out of the inning. Hey, it's hard to win games at any point, but to win games on the road, especially in this ballpark, so they are very happy with this win. Four to two, the final score today. The D-backs took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Zach Grinke earned his ninth win of the year. Andrew Chafin closes the door for the save, his 29th of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.